time passes. It's as if we're going down a river, and it's going very fast. We try to hold on to this, hold on to that, but the Buddha says it's like being swept down a river. And there are grasses on the bank, and so we try to hold on to the grasses to keep from being swept away. But it turns out some of the grasses are sharp, they cut your hand. And others just get pulled out by the roots as you try to hold on to them. There's very little in life that you really can hold on to and be safe. But as the Buddha said, we do have our actions. Those are our real treasures, and those stick with us. The things we do and say and think, where we're acting on intentions, those things go with us. So take good things with you by doing good things. Like right now, you have the opportunity to meditate. Not everybody has this opportunity. They have way too many responsibilities, too many other activities, too many distractions. It's like we're swept down the river, but we've got our heads above the water. So make the most of each breath as it comes in, as it goes out. Look at it as an opportunity to get the mind to settle in and to be able to watch itself. And if you see that the mind is going in a direction it shouldn't go, well, you have the power to change the direction. We do have that much opportunity to control things in the present moment, so take advantage of it. Like right now, you focus on the breath. You can make it really comfortable all the way down in the body. Settle right in, as deeply into the body as you can. And have a strong sense of being grounded. And John Fung used to like to say that he would sit out on the ground. It was his favorite place to meditate. And think of her roots growing down out of the base of his spine, down into the ground. Do your best to feel grounded. That way you don't get swept away. You can see things clearly for what they are as they go past. And for the things that really are useful, you can get use out of them knowing that someday you'll have to let them go. But if you use the opportunities that come your way to create good thoughts, good words, good deeds, then you've made the most of the opportunities you've had. And as life passes away, passes away, you don't feel that it was wasted. That you gain something of real importance, something of real solid value.